Coming up on this edition of Inside the Tribe, we'll take a look back at Bio Week. Plus, Ben will give some smiles and laughs in his new bombastic segment. Inside the Tribe starts right now. Now, from the Raider Nation, and voted one of the best in the Midwest, this is East Peoria's own Inside the Tribe. Thanks for joining us on this week's edition of Inside the Tribe. I'm Ben Hensley. And I'm Anthony Salado. Health Careers Club will meet on Wednesday, April 27th at 3 o'clock in room 101C. Midwest Technical Institute will be here. All current EPCHS students are welcome to attend. An email has been sent out to all students who took the class inversion of driver's ed during the first semester, received their permits in October, and, and who should have received their license in July. Please check your school email to fill out the form to let us know if you are ready to drive or not. Any student that has a band first semester of next year, fall of 2022, please contact Mr. Gonigam at bgonigam at ep309.org or Ms. Romeo at kromeo at ep309.org. If you are in need of a summer job, the school is hiring part-time summer custodial workers for $15 an hour. If you are interested, please email Mr. Du Bois at bdubois at ep309.org. Marching percussion auditions for band are on April 20th, 21st, and the 22nd in the band room from 7 to 9 p.m. Color guard tryouts are April 26th, 27th, and the 28th from 6 to 8 p.m. in the main gym. Seniors, all library books are due now. Please see Ms. Nelson if you have fines or lost books. All fines must be paid before graduation. Any student who needs a ride to Eastside or ICC for practice, there will be a bus leaving from the main entrance. This bus usually departs around 3.30. Book Club is selling coffee in the library before school. Go there if you need some caffeine to start your day. EPCHS refillable insulated water bottles are still for sale. You can purchase them from Hope Club for only $10. See Mr. Hobbs in room 235B. Brooklyn and Kara are back with this week's Raider Report. Big shout out to the softball team who is on a winning streak. The ladies have had seven consecutive wins against IBC, Normal Community, Bloomington, Metamora, Olympia, Williamsville, and East Moline. Fantastic job. Baseball won against Canton Monday, April 11th. Nice job, gentlemen. The boys' tennis team has had recent wins against Lincoln and Effingham. A big shout-out goes out to Connor Watson, who went 3-0 in the triad tournament of the weekend of April 9th. Congratulations to the boys' track team, who had a great performance at the meet on April 12th. Gabe Ziegler-Harris took first in both the 100 and 200-meter dash. Joseph Clark took third in both the 200-meter dash and 300-meter hurdles. Matthew Gray took third in the 400-meter dash. Bailey Webster took third in the 1600 meter dash and got second in the 3200 meter dash. Aiden Thompson took first and Colin Hieronymus took third in the 3200 meter dash. The boys 4x1 relay took third with runners Joseph Clark, Matthew Gray, Jack Brooks, and Gabe Ziegler Harris. And Mason Brown took third in discus. Great job, Raiders. I'm Kira Kual Desolate. And I'm Brooklyn Arrington. Coming up, we'll get a look back on everything Bio Week. And Ben's here to make us smile with his bombastic segment. Because of everything that people like you are doing to raise funds for that hospital, more and more kids are surviving. More and more kids are getting the opportunity to experience what you get to experience. I'm here with Ben Osborne. And why is bio important? Yes, yeah, so St. Jude is pretty much entirely funded by just different schools that do things like this and fundraisers. So all, all across the nation, there's different schools that have these buyout weeks or St. Jude fundraisers, and that's how they get all of their money to do the great things that they do. So it's a great cause. 
And do you think that buyout is fun? Like, do you like do you enjoy buyout? I am enjoying it. The spirit days are always fun, and we haven't been through a lot of today, but I'm looking forward to all the different things that we have. Perfect. Thank you. Welcome to Big Ben's bombastic bombardment of quizzical inquiries. Answer questions, get prizes. What's your name? Ian. What's your last name? Burton. What did your shirt mean? It's a shirt. Oh, yo. Congratulations, you win. Why do you? Why are you still walking? Oh, I thought we were, oh, we're, I thought we were still walking. Okay, so answer questions, win prizes. Understand? Understood. Cool. Good. Uh, what's the question? Answer questions. When, what's your name? Ian Knickerbocker. Ian Knickerbocker. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Say that three times fast. Ian Knickerbocker. Ian Knickerbocker. Ian Knickerbocker. Congratulations. You don't. You haven't won yet. Um, what does an owl call a good time? A hoot. He did it. He did it. He did it. Woo! You win. Here's a shape. Let's go tell everyone that he won. Come on. Come on. Hey, everybody. Ian won. Woo! Give him applause. Ian. Let's go. I want to interview you. Answer questions, win prizes. Do you understand? Oh, we're now? Yes. Okay. Hello, what's your name? Uh, my name is Mr. Simmons. I teach here. Okay. Answer questions, win prizes. Okay. The first question and only question. How are babies made? No one's told me yet. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> do they have to be the right answers? 
How are babies made? No one's told me yet. Uh, in the factory in the sky. Thank you. Have a wonderful rest of your day. Here's your prize. Cool, Saltines. Cool, cool, cool. You have no students. How are you? I'm doing quite well. Awesome. That's good to hear. Have a wonderful rest of your day. What's your name? My name is Adam Teeny. What? My name is Adam Teeny. Congratulations. Thank you. That's awesome. No, congratulations to you. I think I think we don't give enough credit to you, Ben, for what you do in this show right now. I think we need to spend five minutes standing out here in silence to thank Ben for his time on this show. You. No, you win. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Olympic torch. That's not all, but that's all we have time for today. For the full set of announcements, go to the school's website, ep309.org. Also, be sure to follow us on Instagram at inside underscore the tribe. That's all for this week. Thanks for tuning in to this edition of Inside the Tribe. I'm Ben Hensley. And I'm Anthony Salato. And from everyone here at Inside the Tribe, have, have a great, great Raider Day. day.